This morning, a Shelby County mother is remembering her daughter two years later after she was killed while texting and driving. CBS 42 News reporter Hillary Simon met with this, met with her two years ago and was the first person to sit down with her as she told her story. Hillary, now she's becoming a big advocate for safe driving. Art, that's right. Since our interview with Michelle Lunsford almost two years ago, she really has taken a tragedy and made it a purpose. That purpose is to make sure that no other family goes through what she did. Cameron Calloway, also known as Cece, died on February 22nd, 2018 while driving home after work. It was discovered that she was texting and driving, which led to a crash that killed her. Now her mom is visiting schools and speaking to groups about the importance of safe driving. She's even taken it to legislators and is pushing for a bill that would require Alabama to be hands free. I mean, there are times that I'm like, I'm just going to be done. And I'm like, I can't. I mean, I can't. I can't be done. It's too important that people understand this because I wish somebody would have done it for us. I wish somebody would have done it for Cameron. I wish I would have seen another mother on TV saying the same things I am. And maybe we would have listened and it would have made a difference. House Bill 74 would require those driving in Alabama to not have a phone in their hand. It was passed through the House Committee this week. It is now headed to the House floor, and if passed there, it would then move on to the Senate Committee. Now, Lunsford tells me that she's worried what's going to happen this time around with the bill, because last year it did stall in the last phase on the Senate floor, but she is hopeful that legislators will hear her story and vote to make this bill a law. Art, back to you. And